What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel, Taurus, and you enjoy my content, if you ring the little bell, buy my full top, I super duper appreciate you saying, saying, saying. This is a uh, bi weekly reading for some of Taurus. Um, I did get a message in for you guys as I was meditating on your energy. And the message is um, a Taurus is about to make a very bold move. Well, more like 1.5. Um, a Taurus is about to make a very bold move, and then, like, 30 seconds after that, I heard for some power play move. So, you take it out. Resonates. Pretty strong energy there, Taurus. Um, a Taurus is about to make a very bold move. Power play move. You go with your bad self, Taurus. Now, whatever the power play move is, it, it could be career. It could be love. It could be um, uh, career, love. Um, those are two main things I think of. Or anything it could be helping person, place, family, situation. Um, did I say career and love? Just saying. You take it out. Resonates. Um, don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is inner. That that. Eh, 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 eh. Um, time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with you. Free general reading. Um, so. Very important. Only take the messages that resonate with you, Taurus. Just saying. Um, I've already done Caps and Aquarius's reading um, for Minvay on. Um, but I felt guided to do you guys were not next. It was Pisces, but um, I felt guided to do you next. So did. And then I started getting spirit messages. So it was like double confirmation. So just saying. This could resonate if you have force in any aspects of your chart. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Dome, Midday, or Jupiter. If you wouldn't mind sharing these videos on your social media, I'd appreciate it. We're at approximately 2,500 peeps right now. The goal is to get it grow, 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 grow. Just saying. All right, let's do it. I'm going to try to keep it to 20 minutes. Um, we'll see how it goes. Six of Cuts upright. The Empress upright. A particular Taurus has very fond memories of a very high vibrational feminine energy from their past. Very fond memories. This person is a wonderful person and this Taurus knows this. Many, 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 many series of shame events. Is going to occur between this Taurus and this person. Make very smart decisions. Be honest and real. Okay, so you take it out resonates. Whoa, Taurus. Okay. Pretty good one. Um, you take it out resonates and we get adjusted. I don't want to see my bottom. I got uh, sweatpants on. And I went into work that morning and this morning COVID testing my sweatpants. I felt weird doing it, but I did. Just saying. <laughs> um, so for who this resonates with, um, it, it can be, uh, it's at least for one of you guys out there. I heard, um, and I heard a Taurus. So a Taurus has very uh, fond memories of a femme energy from their past. So um, this is the femme energy from your past, Taurus. Um, so if somebody from your past is not somebody right now. Um, that's currently in your life. It is somebody from your past. Um, but I heard you have very fond memories of them. So it could be someone, this is usually the childhood memory. Well, it's some past memories of the past card is actually what it is. Um, some readers strictly say childhood memories card, but it's really not because I looked it up and it's really all encompassing. So I call it the memories of the past card because it is. Um, but however, they are from your past is what I'm trying to say. Um, cause you know, everybody's on different time life paths. Everybody is different ages. So it could be, um, a childhood friend. It could be a schoolmate. It could be a college mate. It could be someone you worked with. Um, it could have been a mutual friend. It could have been, you know, you take it out resonates, but somebody from your past, I don't think they're in current energetic space with you right now. Um, but I heard, um, you have very, very fond memories of them. Um, and I heard, you know, um, this person's like a wonderful person. I heard they're very high vibrational. Um, so currently, their current energetic space right now is they are freaking, they're the Empress energy. Just saying. They are vibrating very, very, very freaking high. That's the highest you can go in the vibrations um, in the tarot. 
Um, just saying, because there's different energy levels and vibration levels for anybody who doesn't know. Knight, king and queen. I'm sorry, um, page, knight, king and queen, emperor, empress, and high priestess. So they are up there, up there, up there. They're the highest vibration I heard from spirit. They are. They're very high vibrational and they're vibing as an empress energy right now. But I heard, um, excuse me, but I heard, um, and it's feminine energy. It's feminine energy from your past. Just saying, just saying. Um, you can be masculine or feminine, but I heard, um, basically, um, you're, um, it sounds like you're going to, um, reach out to this feminine energy is what it sounds like. Um, that's what it sounds like from messages, but you take, you take it out resonates. Of course, you know, it's, if you actually do reach out to this feminine energy, um, you know, you have the choice to reach out to her or not. Um, but it sounds like at least one of you guys is going to. Um, and I heard basically a ton of series of chain of events is going to occur, make smart choices, um, and be very honest and real. So apparently Taurus really needs to hear that. So I'm thinking you're very, um, no, you know, you could be reaching out to her, um, as a friend, you could be reaching out to her as, um, possible, uh, love interest. Um, or a business contact, you take it how it resonates, but I heard they make very smart choices and um, for you when you reach out to this fem energy. Make very smart choices and um, be very honest and real. So um, you take it how it resonates because she's vibing high, so it wouldn't be smart to make bad choices, just saying, just saying, because she'll cut, probably cut your ass off <laughs> if you don't. And if you're not honest and real, I'm sure she'll probably cut your ass off. Um, I mean, anybody with any sense in her head would, just saying. But you take it out, resonates. This is a good one, though. It's a really good one. And I heard in there, for, um, Spirit Message, power play move, that a particular force is going to make a power play move very soon. Um, so um, I'm thinking for some of you guys, you might make the power play move forces Empress Energy. For some, just saying. But it's a fem energy of your past in some type of way, whoever this person is. The star, ace of pentacles. A particular Taurus is extremely successful in their life right now. Extremely. They are about to take on a new side hustle going to be very successful this is wonderful freaking energy for us my god whoever this is for man you guys have just been rocking the hell out of it in the past six seven months and i'm just so serious you guys have been the biggest change in energy energetic spaces in here for sure um you and leo and sag i would say um you leo and sag um in my opinion from you know of course i've been the reader for over a year uh, but in the last six seven months i would say um you leo and sag have been the biggest positive energy shifters um but for who this resonates with i heard um uh whoever this resonates with you're currently very successful you're very successful that's why i have the star card here so you could be dealing with an aquarius or not you take it out resonates because this is aquarius card um major arcana so you take it out resonates if you are you could um they could have aquarius and some moon rising venus or that behavior jupiter you take it out resonates but you are very successful for us you are um that's why you have the star card but um and I strongly feel you are, um, whatever you're successful in, whether it's a, um, your owner of a business or an employment situation or both, um, you're in the public eye because it's upright. And this is public eye card and success all over the freaking place. Um, and um, I heard you're about to take on a new side hustle. So, and it's going to be very successful. And yeah, Ace of Pentacles Upright is a new um, business work or an employment uh, business. Um, investment or um, employment opportunity. Um, very, very new. So whatever this is, I heard you're about to. So um, I think right now it's an ace um, because it's contemplative energy. Maybe you are um, figuring out how to do it. Um, that's what I'm thinking. I think you're planning, strategizing, figuring out how to do it, getting all your ducks in a row before you do it. Um, 
I heard it's going to be very successful. And you got the star card with it. Just saying, just saying. That's freaking wonderful. Side hustle energy. So, um, yeah, side hustle energy. It's wonderful. Spirit messages you have side Taurus. A particular Taurus, Taurus feminine has really matured and grown. She is about to get many blessings. Just really be careful. Protect. Okay. So you take it out resonates. Um, that's for a Taurus femme. You take it out resonates. I heard a particular Taurus femme is... Um, has really grown up and matured basically. So um, if this resonates for you, Taurus fam, you've really um, grown up and matured. Um, you could be 18, you could be 28, you could be 48. You take it out resonates, but I heard you've really grown up and matured and that's wonderful. Um, but I heard um, many wonderful things are basically come, gonna come to you. Um, but spirit message in that was um, protect, protect. So um, just basically be cognizant, aware, have, you know, keep your intuition on point and protect. So I'm assuming protect yourself or protect your finances or protect your children. If you have children, um, just be very cognizant and aware and keep your intuition on point. It is how I'm taking from that. I heard protect. So you take it out resonates. Strength upright. Eight of cups upright. I just had the eight of cups and caps, but hold on. Let me reconfirm it. Oh, no, no. I had Eight of Cups reversed in caps. I'm sorry. This is Eight of Cups upright. Um, feel compelled to walk away from a disappointing situation. Okay. A particular Taurus has very high intuition. Very, very high intuition. They are about to have lots of strength and really walk away. From a very tempting but not good for the good for them situation they know it will bring them down energetically and financially okay so you take it out resonates this is wonderful freaking energy taurus my god you are just freaking rocking it in here rocking the freaking socks off of it uh, for whoever this resonates with i heard um someone is you, at least one of you guys is about to exhibit extreme freaking personal power. Extreme personal power. Um, I had and this could be the power play energy too. Um, you take it out resonates. But um whoever this resonates with, um, I heard um you are about to walk away basically. Um you have very high strong intuition and you're about to walk away from a very um disappointing situation that you know if you put yourself there basically. I heard it's very tempting but very disappointing. So, you know, basically, if you put yourself in this situation, whatever situation it is, it, is, it could be a new investment opportunity, a new business opportunity, or a new um, love opportunity. You take it out resonates. I heard it's very tempting, but um, you know it will bring your money down. So, you take it out resonates. Um, so, you, you're going to have lots of strength. Because you have strength up right you're gonna lost the strength to walk away from it i heard it's very tempting but you know one is not good for you energetically so you know it'll bring your energetic space down um and two um so i'm thinking it might be a person a uh, person or a situation that's very low vibrational is what i'm thinking i'm thinking um whoever this i think it's a person or it yeah i do either a love interest or a toxic friend of me or somebody that's just like into drugs or um or an alcoholic or someone that doesn't want to get their life together um and you are whoever this resonates with you are you have gotten your life together you've gotten it together 
um, or you're getting it together and you don't want any low vibrational peeps around you, whether it's a frenemy, um, a drugie, an alcoholic, or someone that could bring you down energetically, um, or a love interest that's trying to tempt you. I had somebody in here being tempted with booty, young booty in here the other day. So for some, it could be you. I'm just saying. Um, but you take it out resonates, but you're about to have lots of strength, buddy. And you're about to walk away from it um, because you know it'll bring your money down and bring, it could be drugs too, because drugs was in that reading too. It could be drugs, it could be alcohol, um, temptations of drug or alcohol, or a low vibrational love interest that's trying, just manipulating you with ass and titties, basically. Um, just saying. I'm not trying to be crass, but for real, for real. You take it out, resonates. Um, this is wonderful energy, but I heard you're going to walk away. So it's great. You could be dealing with a Leo, possibly, because it's a strength card, um, or not. They could have Leo in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or time, behavior, Jupiter. If you take it out, resonates. If you are, you don't have to be. You just take it out, resonates. Okay, Taurus. Redirecting is what I just heard. Redirecting. Redirecting. So I'm thinking, um, wait. redirecting is what I heard. So you could be redirecting towards this person, possibly, or redirecting towards this. I mean, if all these resonate with you, this could be redirecting energy towards both of these things or one of these things. Or it could even be redirecting towards this or all these. You take it, um, well, you're redirecting away from this. Um, and then it could be towards either one of these or both of these. You take out resonates. Okay. Spirit messages you have us on Taurus. You guys have just been rocking the freaking thoughts off the readings. I mean, I have been so duly impressed. I'm just saying, I have been so freaking impressed. My Tauruses, my Taurins, just saying, I have been so impressed with you guys. Spirit messages you have for um, sign Taurus. Of course, it's all about the action you actually put in your own life. And uh, anybody's been watching me for a hot minute, you know that. I keep saying it, saying it, saying it, because it's true. I want to say when I'm shuffling out, dude, let me tell you, you know, I know so many guys live in different countries, but I live in the United States and, um, the IRS extended the tax, um, season till May 17th. Guess what time I got my taxes done last night. I usually get mine done months in advance, months in advance, even when it was April 15th deadline. OMG, e true story, 1158 p.m. is when I submitted them, federal and state, 11.58 p.m. on May 17th, tax day. Whoa, just saying, but I got them done, and I got a very quick turnaround. I haven't got the money back yet, but um, they're already both submitted in through the federal and the state already. Usually, it takes days for that to even get them submitted in. It took less than eight hours for both. That's awesome. And I'm getting a bigger refund back this year than I got back last year, and I made more this year. Hell yeah, just saying. Artist, leadership, wild. Artist, a particular Taurus is very creative. Very, very, very creative. Uh, they are about to make something for someone else. Putting lots of thought into it. Okay, so you take it how it resonates. That's beautiful energy, Taurus. All right, um, whoever this resonates with, I heard you're very creative, very, very, very creative. So you have artistic vibes, creative vibes. Um, 
you're very creative, my dear. It's beautiful. Um, but I heard you're about to bake something for someone else. Um, you're going to put lots of time, thought, and effort into it. Um, so lots of thought behind it, um, which is beautiful. Um, that's super freaking beautiful. Because, um, you know, if the person really cares about you, just a little side note, if the person truly cares about you, the person that's going to receive this, it could be freaking a piece of crap and they would love it. Is what I'm saying. Uh, because you put the time and thought and effort into even thinking about making it for them. Um, if somebody needs to hear that, I mean, I'm, I'm just saying, maybe that'll help you out with their reaction when they get it. Um, because that's the truth. Um, so that's beautiful. And I'm, I'm not saying it's going to be a piece of crap. I'm not. I don't think it will be. Um, absolutely not. I'm just saying, if they truly care, it is a matter what it's going to be. They will be happy to receive it, is what I'm trying to say. So you have the artist card. Some are going to take on new classes in the artistic field. Expand horizons. Okay, so you take it out resonates. I heard some of you guys are going to take um, classes in the artistic field, expand your horizons. So you take it out resonates. So um, I'm thinking um, painting classes, um, painting or uh, pottery or um, textile or um, uh, you take it out resonates. Some kind of creative um, classes. It's beautiful. It could be um, drawing. Um, you take out resonates. It's beautiful. Leadership. Take charge of the situation. Ooh, take charge of the situation with the exclamation point. Woo. A particular Taurus has a very serious situation in their company right now. Take charge. Handle it. Oh, whoa, that was so strong. Holy God. Oh, you take it out resonates. Somebody needs to hear this. Um, so who, who are this resonates with? I heard in your company. I heard in your company. So whoever this resonates with, you are the owner. You're the owner of the company or you're on the board, like a CEO um, in the company. Uh, you're either on a CEO on the board in the company, top, top dog, top dog, or you are the top dog and you are the owner. Um, you take it out resonates. I heard a very serious situation. So it ain't no baby freaking situation. It is a serious situation, whatever the hell it is. Um, I heard you need to take charge and you need to handle it. I heard handle it. So you need to balls it up and you need to freaking handle it um, for who that resonates with. It will create balance in a huge way. Handle it. Oh, jeez. Okay, so you take it out resonates. I heard it will create balance in a huge way. Handle it. Second time I heard handle it. Strong. Just saying. Somebody needs to hear that. You have the leadership card? Man. And another Taurus in an employment situation is about to really step up. Be way more helpful than they have been in the past. To one particular person in general. Okay, so you take out resonates. I heard for another one of you Torrens, um, you are in an employment situation in some type of way. And um, I heard you're about to really step up and basically um, help out one particular person in general. So whoever this person is in your life more than um, you have in the past. Um, so you take out resonates. So you are exerting leadership, whatever role you're in. Now, you know, you could be in housekeeping, you could be Fortune 500 CEO, well, no, that's the first message. Um, you could be in housekeeping. You could be um, whatever field you're in. Um, you'd be in healthcare, um, housekeeping. Um, you could work at a nail salon. Um, however, that resonates. But um, it's an employment situation of some type. But I heard you're basically going to step it up. You're going to step it up. Maybe you didn't help this person in the past. Maybe you spite or spiteful towards them jealous of them or some something to where you just didn't want to help them. Um, but I heard you're about to really step up and help more than you did in the past. So that's great. You go with your bad self. 
that I'm for some I'm feeling this is the mature maturing energy um the second one uh, the person that's maturing wild someone sees a particular Taurus as wild but they are not and they know it they know it have grown leaps and bounds Someone is going to confront a Taurus about this soon. Stand up for yourself in a huge way. You know the truth. Okay, so you take it out resonates. Um, I heard um, whoever this resonates with, um, Torin, um, I heard uh, basically you've grown. You've grown, matured. You've, you're doing the work. You're doing the work, whoever this is for. You're doing the work. But someone views you, so their viewpoint of you is you're wild. I'm thinking you used to be wild in the past, is what I'm thinking. You used to be a wildling in the past. Um, and so their memories of you, of the past, is of your past. But apparently, I don't think they've been around you recently, is what I'm feeling on this. Um, or they just choose to see, view you as wild. Um, and maybe they know the truth and they just don't want to accept it. You take it out, it resonates. But however that resonates, I heard you're about to be called out. Basically about to be called out by at least one person. Uh, for some, it could be several in your life. You take it out, it resonates. Um, basically calling you wild and viewing you as how you used to be in the past. Um, but I heard you know the truth. You know the truth and basically stand up for yourself and state facts. Um, I didn't hear that part, but that's for me. State facts and basically just... Tell them how it is. You tell them the truth. Tell them the freaking truth. Just saying. Um, you know the truth. I heard you know it in your heart. You know it in reality. And just tell them the truth. So um, you can't refute the truth. If anybody needs to hear that. You cannot refute the truth. I mean, some people try. Some people try. They try to cover it up. They try to refute it. They try to, like, brainwash themselves and others to think other things. But the truth is the truth. Just saying. If anybody needs to hear that. So let me... Um, See if I hear anything else. One particular Taurus, 25 and below, is really getting on the wrong path. Drugs and alcohol. Some prostitution. Not a good idea. Whoa. Oh, dear God. Okay, whoa. Okay, I thought we were done. Oof. Okay, um, and I heard one particular Taurus. I heard 25 or below so you're 25 or below Taurus whoever you are um, you're truly wild whoever this is for um, I heard drug you're getting into with the wrong crowd is what it sounds like I heard drugs alcohol and prostitution for some so um, you truly are wild um, or about to get that way you take it out resonates but you're 25 or below okay here's all I want to say to this um, if this is you for the second one The people you are around usually denotes. I mean, for some people, they're strong enough to pull out of it. They're strong enough to really, you know, they, they, they think with their head and not their loins or their social stigmas. They will pull out and they will do what they know in their heart to do. That strong intuition, strong will. And it, it takes a very strong person to do that. But, um, but for a lot of folks, they don't. They go with the crowd, is what I'm trying to say. And for who this is for, you're going with the crowd, 25 or below for us. It's not a good idea. I mean, everybody has free will, and you, you're you welcome to do that. But I just want to tell you, if this is for you, I used to work in a jail. You might end up in ball, uh, behind bars. And I'm serious. Because you don't understand. I mean, I'm a nurse. Anybody doesn't know I'm an RN. And I assess so many people. My job was to assess these people coming in that got booked in, um, that got arrested. And when I worked there and you don't understand how many people got put there because they went with the crowd. They went with the flow. They did what their friends wanted them to do. And I'm and some of those people freaking 45 years old, 45, 35. They didn't, there wasn't 25 or below. You still have a chance, is what I'm trying to say. You still have a freaking chance. You're young, whoever you are. You're young, young, young. Um, and, of course, you have free will. But going with the crowd is not the way to go in societal 2021 world because it's a whack-ass world out there. 
you're not going to be successful in life if you do that. Um, I feel like somebody needs to do that. All right, let me see if there's anything else. Okay, I didn't. I didn't. All right, we're done. Personal readings currently closed. However, donations super duper, duper greatly appreciated. It's high priestess row five. The links in the description box below. If you'd like to donate, all donations are super duper greatly appreciated. Single mom, two kids, just saying. Um, but if you'd like to donate, you have to do it the right way. Please, please, please. Um, with the cherry on top. There, my links in the description box below. High priestess intuition. Um, it's high priestess row five. Is my link. But. You select your donation amount on there, but there'll be a drop down after you do it. So you have to clear it out and put in donation. It's very important for my tax records. Just saying, um, I'd appreciate it. Um, if you don't do it, I'd just rather you not donate at all. i uh, just being peripheral. All right, you guys, we're done. I'm sorry your reading ran so long, but um, it just kept going. But this is a pretty good reading. All right, I love you guys. Everybody, wonderful choices. My dears, namaste.